Hey, people, I'm going to pick this right up where I left off on this last movie. And we search for a better definition for a polyon. And this is going to tell why uh, why they wanted to kill a polyon by, by the definition, by the Hebrew definition. So I had ended that last movie looking at this line from Jose 6-7. It's a short poem. Looking at this over of writ and transgress the covenant. They overrid it. And if you're looking at one without the vowel points, you, know, you might pronounce this Brit, B-R-I-T, Brit, and Shin, the British. British from, M is from. Pronounces S on the end, but it, it still means from. And I'm going to look at these next two lines down here. The next one is where uh, Polyon comes from, the Polyon. Glad for it, Polyon of in the muds. And so this isn't Polyon, like I say, this is Glad for it, Poly, many, new, K-N-E-W. A makes me read this backwards. And so it's many new, glad for it that many new, that somebody had overwrit the over over of writ that transgressed the covenant and glad for it that Polly knew that many knew and so uh that's why Polyon is the destroyer because many knew and they tried to overwrite the covenant but Polyon destroyed it because many knew of in the muds, M D S. You know, this is an M, the mud from, or the muds. And then this next line here, this this word, uh, to Koki, you know, K H, and as in Noah, Noah is just spelled N H, Noah. And so the H is, is pronounced O when it's between vowels, in Koki. And Koki and and as lion wait for. And uh, it was just accident that I run into how they come up with this interpretation as lion wait for and Koki to Koki. And so this is Koki. And uh, we know it pronounces Koki because Koki tells us. And Koki is a frog. You'll see on the, the banner that uh, Azazel carries, he's got Koki's lays on his banner. And so Koki was an ancient god and they've been carving petroglyphs in the rock forever in Puerto Rico big time. And, uh, and they had this old legend, there's a legend explaining the birth of Koki. And there was a goddess who fell in love with Koki, the chief's son. She told him she would come one evening, but she never came. What did come was the evil hurricane, the her hurricane, the deity of chaos and disorder. The sky blackened as the winds quickened. It says hurricane all over it. The goddess tried to protect her lover. But Hurricane grabbed him and drug him away, and they never saw each other again. In order to cope with the loss of her Koki, she created a frog that will never, that will forever call out his name, Koki, Koki. Hence the birth of Koki. And so um, she told him that she would come one evening, but she never came. And as lie and wait for. Koki. So, you know, what this tells me is, you know, they're lying about our history. You know, this, uh, the book is is way older and world travel is way older than what they're telling us. 
So in the last line of this poem, in 11, it, um, you can see the word that they're teasing. They do this a lot. If you look at the last line in every poem, it'll help you interpret the first one. And it's in shovey shove. When I return the captors, in shovey shove what to me. In shovey shove what to me. And, uh, and so this shovey shove, this is where you get your word shovel and, uh, and shove. And it's also where your word sheave and shevy comes from. But uh, it's this word's twisted around like this uh, in the first line. And it's, it's here, when shove. And so people like to think that a, a shovel is for digging holes, but... And actually, it's, it's not. A shovel is used to cover up the holes. This is a, a shovel. A spade has a sharp point on it for digging and cutting roots. And the shovel is designed for pushing snow, pushing ice in the ice house, or pushing loose dirt back in the hole. And, uh, and that's why you see this old word for shovel is also shoal, as in hell, the word they give hell in the Bible. And so this is when they're covering you back up, the shovel. And so like to, when shovel, you can see, uh, you put it here, you see their pronounced page, von shovel. When shovel have you give who? The trap. Who rapping to Jack who Habs knew and so um Jack means to steal you know when you tell him a story uh, you know that's why Jacob Jack comes from Jacob and uh, Jacob wasn't supposed to get the the birthright it's supposed to be Esau but he jacked it and that's where your word Jack come from. Jack is the one who ended up with the goods. If you're telling a story, and uh, James is the old word for the, the one who's supposed to follow the king. The James is the one who's supposed to have it. Jack is the one who ended up with it. And Jimmy is a, is a tool, you know, uh, that a thief carries to... Jimmy is the tool you use to jack something. And so when you're telling a story with Jack and Jimmy and James, you know, all the names have a meaning. But like, like when shovel have you give who trap who rapping to rap, rape, reap, to reap into, dig them a hole. And Jack, who, which, which Habs knew, a Habs knew, you know, a, 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 a new guy, the new guy, the Habs knew. Itching to, from itching when Jimmy's buy us this lease, if I'm new when high of place to. And, and so itching, itching them, Jimmy's. You know, itching them is you, you wanting the days to pass, the Jimmy's. Itching, itching, when, itching them, Jimmy's, by us the lease. You know, you're, you don't own anything here. You know, you're just leasing your time on earth. By us the lease, if I'm new. If, if you knew the day that when high of place, when your lease, if you knew the day that your, your lease was high, you know, when it got to its peak, before you go down of place. The window neared pellet. Window neared pellet at, the pellet date, the, the pell date, the pellet, the pell at. A pell is a audit, you know, a pelt is a skin, 
you know, you do the audit, you collect skins, as in scalping. The window is the time, you know, the hole is coming by the window is a, a period of time in that window. We need to be there between 4 o'clock and 5 o'clock is our window. The window near, and that, that time was coming near of the pellet date, the audit date, to have you. Kashar Naquin, from what saw, who view give gashes of new. And so Kashar is, is almost the morning, the Shar, S-H. R, uh, S, the fires divide first into give Shar, Kashir. It's the first morning light, the first light shining through. Knock when, knock when. It means, you know, when it arrives, it knocks. You knock on the door. You know, this is this is knock when, and it's uh, you know, it's it's to let you know the time. And you also have a knock in here. It reads backwards, forwards, and knock in, and that's the one that fits in its place tightly. It's got to be knocked in. But uh, when, the, when the morning light knock when, from what saw, from W-X-T-S-A-W, from what saw, who view to give gushes, when it says that it rained on uh, Noah, it says gushes, it came gushing down a lot, give gushes. Of new come lift us your chair, your, why you are your chair. M-E is, is me, or from life, this, backwards, this so, a call, backwards and forwards, this so a call, come my reap. From life, this so a call, come my reap. That, you know, if you know the time that you're going to go. From life, this so a clock, you would. A clock, you would. Which is Dick's con and roof before? To kettle, musk is the like. Which is dicks? You know, dicks is like dictate. You know, the the one with the say, the one with the no and the say. Which is dicks? Conning. You know, con is control. And conning officer is dictating the commands to the con, to the control of the ship. Which is Dick's con and the roof in before. It's not necessarily the morning, but it's the stars that came before the morning. The roof before. When you can see the roof and the stars, that's where you dictate the con. You gotta look at the stars the night before. The night before. So you, so you know. And to kettle. The musk is the like. To do, as like the dew, the early morning dew, the kettle. You know, what you're brewing up for coffee, to the kettle, musk. Musk is. Musk is something that puts out a smell to the coffee. To the kettle musk. To the, to the morning coffee, the like. And so, uh, you know, you don't always have coffee. Sometimes you got to go searching for something else to to put in your kettle. So that's why it's to the kettle musk instead of Joe or coffee or something because you don't always get coffee. You got to go scrounging for something. And when I don't have anything from a morning musk, I'll uh, I break some dried up twigs off this old yopon holly and and brew them up, and it's it's pretty good stuff. It's really good if you don't have anything. You can uh, dry up some leaves or the root bark, and it's called the black drink. That 
the Indians would come to the East Coast is where this grows. Every winter they would come to the East Coast and the coast and they would have a ceremony and they would cook up the black drink out of this and and it's got some hallucinogenic properties to it and that's why they were called savages because they they would come out there and and have their their annual black drink party. All knocking hex of it. Benvia is urge it is. In homery, yippee, and mash pot jack, row it see. And so all knocking, all fitting hex of it, the hex in tie, and the, the hex, they used to say hex is, uh, is the court, it's because they were all hex shaped. Look at the pictures of ancient senates in the courts so are hex shaped. Hex is something you cook up, you know, out of a of a fish eye and a and a leaf of a holly and and some bat wings. A hex, the hex in tie. Ben via is been on the road via via is when something is transported on the on the road. Been on the road. Been via, been in transport. How it got there via, you know, on the road, on the ship, however it got there is in transport. Been via is, you've been on the road. The urge it is in Homer make, in command make. Make pie, make circle, and mash to mash pot jack. Mash pot jack is is when you're not supposed to be cooking up some liquor, you know, like in the jailhouse and the toilet or in a boat, you know, take a can of peaches and 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 triple up the the yeast in it so it kicks off real quick in three days. Mash pot jack. The row it see the row is not light, row is the color. It's the it's the the color of that row and that's what they're talking about light and so it's in the in the color at sea the mash pot jack of the row at sea kissed habit stay will you know kissed hope will it hope it will stay hope it stay will halves in who that and who would act from yell em all what? So from from yell em all what? From yellow mullet. This is a, a mullet. And it's a, it's a star, it's a spur. Sometimes it's a spur on your heel. A mullet. And it's part of heraldry and in, in coat of arms, mullet, and on flags. Those are all mullets on the United States flag. You're not stars or mullets. To them, the code's over of writ. She's bag divy. Them, the code's over writ. You know, that's the doctors, and they're writing like a like they're they're writing the, the log of the tour but they're also putting the codes of uh, the medicines and astrology in here and so to them to them em is them to them life to them the codes but eme is also blood is helma helma eme to the blood codes over of writ. She's bagged du Dubai. And uh, so bag, you know, every time you see like Baghdad, every time you see bag in, in one of those uh, country names, or bag means garden, the garden of Dubai. So, so Dubai, it don't have bag in the name anymore. It turned into a desert. It didn't have a garden for a long time, but in ancient times they did have a garden.
But this is what the Garden of Dubai looks like now. It's, it's famous. Dubai looks like this. It's located here. It's just a small country here. It's just sitting off over here by Saudi Arabia. I've been by there one time. But yeah, it's on the other side of the world. If you want to get on a boat and come sail over here through the Med and, and come through the Suez Canal and come out here and watch out for these pirates out here. A lot of pirates at these points. And, uh, and sail up in here. Hot, nasty water full of sharks and snakes here. And, uh, they build in they got a huge amount of money now. They uh, they found oil in the 60s. And so they're building these islands. But there's two things that they grew in their in their garden in antiquity. And the earliest written record in Dubai is uh, 1580. But they have history from 7000 BC. And so they, they found that um, when they were building this road in, in 1990, Five or so, they found remnants of a mangrove swamp. It let them know that the waterfront was in a different place, dated 7,000 years ago. So they're figuring that the the coastline had moved, or, or 9,000 years ago, and the coastline had moved 5,000 years ago. And uh, and from the traces from the record left, they see that the nomadic cattle herders was living there until they started a date palm. They started growing date palms. They figured it around 4,500 years ago. Oh, that's right around the, the time as the Narmer palette. And that would be his old trademark, his signature. You see here with his old date palm and his old pea shoe. You see him here with his old palm. And it changes up. There's clues here. Because you got a seven leaf palm here. And this is P. Pai Shu. Means, pai Shu means the ruler. means a cubit. It's the distance here. From the wrist to the elbow. Twelve inches. You see here it changes up. It's a six. Six palm. And so there's codes all through this. That archaeologists aren't understanding but yeah that was about the time of the Narmer palette and they started growing the date palm and previous to this the garden the, all, the only thing they farmed there was pearls and so it, it seems to me that uh, you know they they know about this history and, and that uh, that's that's an old palm tree and that's also where you would farm pearls Seem like they're trying to keep this knowledge hidden just for the for the, the kings, the the royalty, the roys. So this transgressed the covenant, you know, is in writ. And this is where you get your word overt, O V R U, overt. The codes overt in writ. The the hidden in the writ and them the codes overt in writ. She's bagged doobie there they dealt treacherously you know it's all it's pirates at all them ports they they go out there and, and try to stop every boat glad for it polly knew of in the muds you know this is polly p-o-l-y so people didn't, didn't understand that a words read backwards they read this polly on it comes up many many times polly on and so this new, you know, it could be, you know, the cycle connected is in a new year, a new A, new knowledge, or just K-N-E-W, the new, the many new, many new knowledge of B muds, of in the muds. And so matter, you know, mad is the color of red, matter roots where the red dye come from, and, uh, in, in mud, you know, it, M is water, and D is, is through. 
So, uh, you, know, you make muds. Coffee is a mud. You pour water through your, through your grounds, you know, mud. So when you see these words in parentheses, that means that they're not claiming these words are here. They're just saying that whoever wrote this forgot to put them in and they thought they should be here. And so without them, you know, it says in Koki, and as lie in wait for a man, bands of the company of priests on the way. So they're lying in wait of the bands of the company of priests on the way. Not robbers, that's something just meritoriously added for King James. It was never in there before. The bands of the company of priests on the way murder to Shem. Surely lewdness they commit. So this is probably read better to to Kuki siege duties over Connie's. And Connie's the dogs or the priests. And over, you know, H is divide in first. To divide in first, you know, that would be over. One over three, you know, divide in first. One third. Over, divide in first. Over. Into Koki, C S I A G. The siege duties, D U D I S. And, uh, and I've seen it in many other places where this duty's at, so I must figure out what that's what that is. And kooky siege duties over the Connies. And the dark wrecks who them make cash shack. They make cash sack from the keys from the Ashu. Somebody's making cash. Making a cash sack from the keys from the Ashu. Ashu in a shippu. And uh, you can get some good information here, ancient Mesopotamia. But a lot of them are going to are gonna feed you a lot of witch doctor stuff there. And you can get some good information, but they're going to try to put some bad information in there. You know, people like to think that they're so smart because they graduated. But, you know, they can't even read the ancient writings. There's a reason why the, the Roman church tried to burn down all the ancient libraries. But the Ashu and the Shippu, the, Ash, the Shippu was an astrologer and a witch doctor. And he would come out with, a, he would come out and see you with his knowledge of astrology and placebos. And, and he would try to fix you with his, with, uh, with psychology. And if he couldn't do it, you know, then they would send a, a shoe out to see, and he was mastered all that, and he mastered herbal medicine, and he knew how to read this well. And this old kooky here, he was he was like uh, the mascot of the fallen angels, and uh, it was in all this old uh, this old demon art. It was with Ball here. And oh, Azazel, that's who he marches for. You can see him, you know, he's on the flag of Azazel. You can see him better here in this colored picture. And you often see Polyon dressed up like the, the green tree frog. And this has to do with, with getting rid of, uh, with jaundice and the old sun worshippers. And the child who is suffering from jaundice, they catch a small frog live and uh, and mix it up with the medicine in the sun. And yeah, the, the sun, the yellow sun, cures jaundice. And uh, they did something with this frog amongst it. And so Koki got his name from what he says, Koki, the way Adam named things by by what they did, you know, a cow was a moo, and a koki was the male koki frog. And they've been long known to be medicines. You find ancient rocks carved in Puerto Rico, Mona Island, and aspects of the way of life and custom arts and beliefs. Koki symbols shown repeatedly portrays the influence of the koki on the art and decorative works, on pottery and poetry. 
So this probably raised the Takuki siege the duties over the Connie's over the Connie's door the Kirch you know they, they'll give that uh, that see that D-E-R-C-H they'll give that K the C-H the door church the church who and the church is the to give the R-X the church, you know, the RX, that's the, that's the symbol of the Roman Catholic Church, the Chiro, the RX. You have the church who, them cash sack from the keys from the Ashu, and the doctor. And so these in parentheses, a lot of times they'll mistake them and put the wrong word in, but they'll always be very similar, usually just one letter difference. You see this S O R Y and this is S O R U, S O R V. So this is sorrow and this is sorry. Invite his ruler. It it is sorry. Ry, rise of of twisted face. And so uh you remember the title of this chapter was Unrepentant. Israel and Judah are unrepentant. <laughs> but it, uh, it says just the opposite down here. Invite his ruler. It is sorry. Rises. Zen. Rises in what? Of present. Of present from of presentum his rule goes the do you would sit fixer like goes the do you would fixer like in shovey shove what to me in shovey shove what to me that's an ancient banking term as in kickback and you can see out here on the shovel, you see a whole lot of reds over here. This means they don't have a page on this. And they really don't have a page on the banker's shovel. Goes the do you would set fixer like in shovey shove what to me. And so, you know, that's why you got to read this like a hundred times. Every time I read a chapter, I pick something else up out of it. And these last, these last few lines, you know, will help you pick up something else back at the beginning and pick up a couple of these words that you're not sure about and give a different meaning to some of the words. But, but you know, like to and shove all, shove all, have you give who? Trap, the trip. Who, who rape unto, who rape unto Jack Steel, who habs unto. All right, I'm going to cut this off here, and uh, I'm going I'm to keep on backing up to how I got here. And uh, it looks like I was chasing this word, polyon, when I got here. And uh, it looked like I was reading on from Psalms. I don't remember where I came from now. But you can see how early I will destroy. And this is the Aximit. And they give it I will destroy because it has Polyon down here. And so everybody knew that somewhere on this page is supposed to meant destroy. But it starts with an A. And so, you know, this is the same word for James, J-M-X-A. That's what James looked like. But it, it it starts with a T and it's actually times here. Of before his times the call Joser say. And so you know the wicked, that's Joser, the king of Egypt. That they kind of try to rub him off everything you can't find a whole lot about of him. To call Joser Say the share arts, the share 
to, to share arts, to share the RX, the drugs of the crit, of the crit, crit is secret writings of the K-R-I-T, secret writings, the drugs of the crit, mayor from, from whore, you know, the city is the whore, and, the, and, and from the whore is the mayor. The mayor have you call ill Apollyon. It's actually a poly up ill of many new. Alright, good day.